All right, so we're gonna be working through the pull-up variations and we've got Harry with his shirt off just to keep you engaged for a little bit longer. So we're gonna be jumping up using the strict pull-up first because it's our fundamental way of pulling our body above a bar. And we need to develop the strength and the soft tissue in the strict pull-up before we progress to the kipping stuff to make sure that we keep our soft tissue healthy. So essentially we're gonna jump up and hang from the bar to start the movement. So hanging from the bottom, we're gonna go through passive and active range. So passive range would be anywhere where your shoulders are hitting your ears. Active means we're actively pulling our scaps into the right position, keeping our abs engaged and getting our arms in the right spot before we can start to activate our lats to pull our body over the bar. So actively pulling our scaps in position and then we're gonna pull our chin above the bar. Ideally, we wanna hold at the top and it's gonna get quite hard, so I'm gonna let him come back down. At the top, we know that our lats uh, are a shoulder extension and adduction by pulling our bar, uh, arms into our body. So we wanna make sure we activate our lats by pulling our elbows in towards our midline and using them as much as possible. So if we jump up to the top, the most common problem we see with a pull-up is flared elbows. So show us a bad example. Elbows go out to the side, we wanna tuck them in against the midline and you're gonna feel that switch on nice and strong there hold that position above the bar, and then keep those elbows tucked in throughout the entire movement to get those lats active and keep the shoulders healthy.